we have uh, Azrael uh, is has a Sephiroth secondary, okay. uh, mains Cloud, so that's that's kind of that. <laughs> <laughs> Cannon picks. Exactly. Uh, we have M4E, uh, probably the best Sephiroth we have in EU, an Italian player, probably the best player in Italy at this point. Well, we're gonna get, see if Burst is also able to pilot Sephiroth to great heights as we go against Kamex the Sonic. Definitely don't see this matchup quite frequently with mm -hmm. uh, Sonic and, and Sephiroth, but I suspect it's going to be pretty challenging for... Yeah, the thing that really defines Sephiroth is that, that not mega defensive, but that really effective walling playstyle. And Sonic just doesn't care. Uh, he has so many options to get in, but also so many options to get out. And that is really dangerous for Sephiroth because he's going to have some trouble with actually fighting the hits. But the wing is online, but the KO almost for Kamex here after the up B gets another upper but falls out of it. Burst, very bad position. This would all catch up once again to jump into the, the, the up smash, but barely not connecting in there. And now we have Sephiroth in a strong position because if Sonic does not have a hitbox on the upbeat, which he does not, the down air is going to be a very strong spike there. Yeah, very true. Now we're seeing Burst kind of attack on some extra damage with utilizing Wing to. Oh, the footstool out of nowhere. Sure. But really utilizing, uh, you know, Wing and trying to get some extra damage tacked on onto Sonic. Good grab there by Kamex. Interesting that uh, Kamex utilizes his side B into up air more so than just going for the raw forward air. Yeah. Um, very curious to see how that progresses in the match. Yeah, especially after the spin that you can just drag people off the stage and get the KO that way. But maybe just the upper does have a very uh, early auto cancel window just to catch more damage in, I guess. Right. Uh, but maybe for the KO, that wouldn't be the best idea. Another whiffed up smash going to get punished by the forward tilt. And now Sephiroth without the wing in a bit of trouble. Very light character. And now Sonic in a position to get the KO. No back throw. Just gonna get the four throw in. And the springs are coming out. Okay. Should still be able to make this back. Oh, but a great homing attack by Kamex actually getting the KO there. I did not see him going for a homing attack. I definitely <laughs> thought we were gonna get the springs for yeah. a couple more seconds. Speaking of those up airs, these chain into one another so nicely. Yeah, and the thing about that upper is um, the one frame after the hitbox comes out, it auto cancels instantly. So it's super strong to, to keep conversions going, get the damage in. Uh, but it's it's kind of a hard making hitbox to land because you have to actively anti air somewhere. Right, right. Uh, but the comics currently do a very good job at, at keeping uh, 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 burst in their on their toes. 75% wing is almost going to be online. But Kamex currently also receiving some punishment for uh, his overcommitment sometimes. And now Sephiroth in the right position. There's the wing. That's going to be dangerous. Oh my goodness. They were looking for that. <laughs> yeah, they were, I was going to say, every time Sonic is, you know, jumping up, throwing those up airs, I get more and more scared. But uh, now Kamex with a... Decent size lead, trying to rack on some extra percent. Oh, try to watch out how you land. Okay. Not getting the punish on that homing attack and the let it rip. And now this is a very bad situation against Sonic, but right. Sonic can just run circles around him. Kamex is currently doing a great job at just playing a little bit safer than, he, than they used before. He's gonna get a 59% already, no wing in sight for Sephiroth. Burst having a bit of trouble here. Kamex doing a great job of, you know, converting off of these missed opportunities by, by first. You know, that raw dash attack coming in, getting punished, and now Kamex just continuing to... Yeah, those up airs. That was intense. Interesting. I feel like they wanted to go for the down air, actually. Uh, oh, or, uh, first wanted to go for the down air. Mm -hmm. So, but... Yeah, that's also kind of a hard thing because Sephiroth doesn't have like the greatest escape options uh, in this advantage. Right. So you kind of have to, to either air dodge or accept it. Yeah. This sequence here was just mean. <laughs> We're like, okay, where's the spring? Nope. <laughs> Take the home and attack. Enjoy. Just gonna do it that way. Again, a, a good point. If a good thing you pointed out is we see comics go a, a lot more for these up pairs instead of like these these forwards that you you were used to seeing from other Sonic Don't players. Uh, maybe finding their niche. Yeah, yeah, okay. They they Sephiroth. they wanted to down air there, which oh, is kind okay. of a greedy option. Oh, the Sephiroth. Yeah, yeah. Sephiroth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But, but uh, I, 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 sure, I guess. <laughs> 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 All right, hold on, Lassian. Smaller stage. Let's see how this is going to turn out. A lot less room for Sonic to run around with, but we have the platform in the middle, which means larger room for auto cancels here. Okay, 
slowly adding more damage. Great reuse of that neutral air to catch the approach from Kamex there. And an anti air with the upper. So many times being caught out here from Kamex. And the wing already online, not even 30 seconds into the match. Yeah, Kamex doing a good job of just tying everything together. And pretty close even game, but it just feels like to me that Kamex is doing a good job of playing his pace, playing his game, and the Sephiroth is just having a tough time getting things started. I mean, it's separate, yeah, you, you do have some conversion out of neutral, but you just have to be, get your damage out of walling people out, and, and Burst having so much Start trouble with that. Back here, so yeah, exactly. Yeah, trying to poke the voter too. Okay. Oh, actually, not getting uh, punished for that air dodge. Great oh. forward air, getting ch the charge off the new, the up the, and hitting the KO, KO there for comics. Great stuff. Oh, comics trying to push that lead to greater heights. Getting already some small conversions here and there, but they want more. And uh, these up bears have been doing so much work. Four comics here, adding slowly but surely to their percentage counter off uh, first year. I thought we were going to see a yeah. attack. <laughs> I got scared. I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> I'm not even playing and I felt my life flash yeah, before my eyes. For sure. <laughs> Burst there with taking the, the second the first stock with the raw dash attack and let's see if Burst can mount a bit of a comeback here. It's gonna be tough. Oh wow. That forward smash is such a dangerous I mean, I, there was a clip from uh, I saw from a, a German smash player. Oh my god, I call it with a backer. But I, I saw a clip where Sonic 4 smash outrage Sephiroth backer. <laughs> that oh move is goodness, ridiculous. Really? Yeah. That's nuts. Yeah, he does have a pretty long arm, which is pretty weird. <laughs> <laughs> big arm, big physique. Yeah, it's, it's that step four, man. It's such a big, big part of why that move works the way it does. Yeah. Uh, but Comics actually being an entire stock ahead at this point, and they just keep on pushing. It's a greater height. It's another up air. Not going to get the KO this time. He, like, like we were pointing out in the last game, he went for that down air again after getting up air chained. And, you know, if Kamex picks up on that, he's going to definitely punish him for it and take away, take away a game two and uh, walk deeper down into the winner's bracket. Okay, no. Your position for burst here. Oh, great, great homing attack. Not gonna get the KO, but it is gonna reverse the situation there. And the backer is gonna keep the Kamex in their last stock. I feel like back air for Sephiroth in this matchup in particular is so tough to land because Sonic is very rarely in his standard position. So yeah. to always land, to always try to fish for those back airs. Mm -hmm. Well, he's getting them now, but oh, they're definitely jump. more tough. Oh, yeah, for sure. Is, <laughs> Almost gets the call out with the side B there versus those. But all right, we're in a dangerous situation for both players. Wings online. Kamex is just looking for one conversion. Oh, actually, great tech there, but the four tilt. The eyeing that towers, it looked like. It was high enough percent where I wonder if the eye was going to matter. Yeah, that's right? true as he well. He might have yeah. just been dead anyway, but. It, it was a horrible eye. <laughs> That was what a what a showing by uh, yeah. Kamex. I mean, if we're looking here at the seeds, we got seed thirty nine taking out seed seven. Mm -hmm, uh, so mm -hmm. that's interesting. I'm not sure like how accurate that is. I but mean, it is winners quarters already. So oh yeah. So wow. we are more uh, we are advancing slowly in the pool, but it's still right. still good upset here, which means right. that Kamex already made an upset along the way here. True, true. I wonder if Kamex is from the the New York City region, but his Sonic was he absolutely. Is. Oh yeah, okay, he is. Okay. okay, okay, cool. Yeah, he was. Definitely playing lights out, landing yeah. all those conversions, and this homing attack was Beautiful. so raw. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I was like, "Wait a minute, why are you doing this?" Yeah, I thought Severov was dead, but no, he, he hung true. on to one of those jumps. True. Uh, I just want to see the angle of the four tilt again. It's such a, a nasty angle. Even if you if they survived it, yeah. Look, look at that. That that's a whoop. <laughs> yeah, just straight away. <laughs> straight line. Yeah. Like yeah. even if you have to recover, you you do have free jumps. But what we saw with with the springs, right? Uh, uh, very effective from Kamex, uh, yeah. not allowing Sephiroth to get Whether back from that. Whether it's the spring or the forward air, he, he's definitely going to try to continue catching you mm -hmm. off stage. But mm -hmm. excellent job to Kamex taking his winner's quarters match. Um, amazing matches again. You know, if you're just tuning in, mm -hmm. hello. <laughs> it's been quite the evening thus far. We sure. are at one of the most stacked locals here in New York City. Uh, the pre-local to mm -hmm. Let's Make Big Moves going on this weekend. Uh, mm -hmm. And we have a ton of amazing talent. Mm -hmm. um, so we'll see who's coming up next. Oh, we got DTP versus our very own Dill. Okay, okay. We got Dill, who's a Rob main, in case you don't know. Oh, yeah, I, I, I've seen some.